uh, Mary Lou. Uh, she's a high school science teacher in Weston, Massachusetts, and she's joining us live to talk about this really cool program. Okay, as a teacher, I've got a teacher in my house. My wife uh, teaches middle school. Uh, how's it been for you uh, having to teach remotely and everything? Has it been weird? Yeah, I mean, it's a whole new world. <laughs> Everyone's learning something new. Yeah, I, 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 little did we know that we would uh, all be like Zoom professors. Uh, okay, so let's talk about this. What, what is this program called? It's called Lab Exchange, and it's a free online science education platform launched by the Amgen Foundation and Harvard University. And you were a beta tester for this, right? So you've been working with it and playing around with it. So tell us a little bit some of the features uh, that, that people can find and how it can help their kids. Yeah, so uh, even as a teacher, I've actually developed co my own content and content for them. But the things I use the most are actually their virtual simulation. Um, because I'm looking for a way to bring in that hands-on science experiment experience where you can experiment with the tools, make mistakes and oh. see what happens. These simulations allow you to do all of that. All the actions you take actually have an impact on your results. So there isn't only one outcome. Um, there are a whole bunch of different ones depending on what you do, the order you do it in, if you do too much or too little. So it's great because it brings some of that joy of exploring back into the classroom. Um, they can try it out and see what happens. That is very interesting. I didn't realize you could change the settings like that. So you really do get a, a feeling of what it's like uh, to do a, a study like that. Yeah, all of the all of the settings you can change. You can change all the tools that you're using. You can use the tools in any order. Um, they really have left it open for for learners, not just students, but anybody to, to play with. Now, uh, you say anybody to play with. Uh, so is it's free? So we can all just hop on and, 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 and use it and play with our kids and stuff? Yeah. That. It's completely free um, on labexchange.org. All you have to do is go and, and the website is open and available. You could even try it on your phone if you want. <laughs> that is very cool because you normally don't get a lot of free stuff from Harvard. <laughs> you used to have to pay a lot for, the, for Harvard true. education. <laughs> uh, and now, uh, we got to go because we're running out of time here, but I would like to give you some kudos for keeping that orchid alive through this COVID period <laughs> that's behind you right there because uh, I've pretty much killed all the plants in my house. Uh, thanks. Uh, if people want more information <laughs> about less this, and more. exactly. Uh, if people want more information about this program uh, and how to log on and everything, uh, where do they need to go? Just labexchange.org, and that's exchange with an X. So labxchange.org. All right. Thank you so much for joining us. I feel like if you had been my teacher, I would have turned out better. <laughs> uh, but uh, there you go. It's a free program from Harvard. That's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yeah. All right. Back to you, Tina. Thanks.